Guys, I have a doubt about the ecosystem. I have a class project going. Do you, guys, do you guys know anything about it? Okay, so just the basic um, meaning. An ecosystem is an interconnected community where biotic factors interact with the abiotic factors. These uh, biotic factors are, you know, the organisms, bacteria and all that. Bacteria, animals, plants. And then the abiotic factors are the environment, you know, water and everything. Yeah. Okay. Um, there are four, I think, four key components of an ecosystem. That is the, I only know one though, it is the decomposers. Decomposers are the ones that um, they convert, um, you know, organic matter like manure into usable nutrients into, um, that can be used by producers. You know what producers are? I forgot what it is. Producers. Oh, producers are like the living uh, photosynthetic organisms. They like convert uh, nutrients and water with sunlight into food. They are like the base of the ecosystem because they produce all the food that everything lives on. Hmm. <coughs> so guys, how do we foster health, nutrition and well-being? Oh, I know some of this. We can like promote uh, eating more fruits and vegetables. Uh, and uh, fats, healthy fats and proteins in our diet. We should also reduce overconsumption and just eat what we need. And they have, do they know anything else about this nutrition? Um, for communities, we should provide more, uh, more, more access to nutritional food uh, in the underdeveloped countries, also known as the um, food deserts. And then, um, hey, um, Ishan, do you know anything about mental health? Yeah, I think I do. So we should like promote uh, mental health access. Also, we have to like provide like men, uh, mental health awareness for like for both men and women. Oh, I, I forgot to add one more point. Health. We should also uh, what is it? Encourage a healthy l lifestyle. Doing exercise, swimming, all that is a healthy lifestyle. Oh yeah, I, I got something else about mental health. We have to like reach out to the people we know. It can be our family, our friends or any like healthcare therapist. So guys, all this talk about health and ecosystems has got me thinking. What are the technological innovations for these? Rehan, do you have any ideas? Yeah, there are several technological innovations that have a potential to possibly impact ecosystems and health. Some, one includes the 3D um, printing of prosthetics for customization of you know, limbs. When they lose a limb, they have to get prosthetic. So that will be easier if it's 3D printed. Do you have anything else? You want yeah, to there's add? also like satellites in space where like yeah, there's like there's like very advanced uh, sensors which can monitor changes in our ecosystem and our wildlife. This is essential because we need to know what's going on with our wildlife. And since the, in the current time, we are we are like losing a lot of exotic plants and animals. Also, artificial intelligence and machine learning are being used to accelerate drug discovery, potentially leading to more effective treatments for various health conditions including diseases that affect ecosystems such as wildlife diseases. So guys, I need to go right now. Bye. Bye. <laughs>
human activities and environmental factors. They provide essential services to humans.